the least squares regression equation here. They give us what the equation is. This is the model for the data. So we have y y hat is 731.6x plus 15,374. In this case, the y represents the median income, and x is the percentage of of 25 years or older with at least a bachelor's degree in the, in the region. So we have a scatter diagram here. It indicates the linear relation between the two variables. And they give us the correlation coefficient. The R right here. is 0.6585. So it's somewhat linear. Okay, complete parts A through D. Uh, predicted median. So that we have, with the model, we can make a prediction. In this case here, x is going to be 35 so we plug into the model here and we make that prediction using this model we end up with forty thousand nine hundred eighty dollars in the particular region thirty one point one percent of the adults have at least a bs degree uh, the, the median income in this region is thirty five thousand Uh, is this income higher than what you expect and why? Okay. Uh, determine the median income. So, calculate the median income for 31% of adults with 25 year. So, we can do this with predicting. Again, in this case, we plug in 31.1. We end up with 38,127. It's 35, which is lower than the predicted. So the as, this is a model. The model predicted 38. The actual here looks like um, it's 35. So in this case here, the slope of the line. So we look at this again. We have a y equal to mx plus b. In this case, our slope is 31.6. So for, therefore, for every increase, for every percent increase uh, in the percentage of adults with at least a, a bachelor's degree, the median income increases by $731.60 on average. Explain why it doesn't make sense to interpret the y-intercept. Okay, so we're looking at this here. So in this case here, when where x is the percentage of 25 and older with at least a bachelor's degree. So if we had here, if if it was zero, zero is possible. Because it's possible for no adults to have a BS degree. Okay. Mm -hmm. Um. If you look at the data here on the x-axis, data is going between 15 and 60. So zero is not within the scope of the model. It's outside of the scope of the model. So, it's so it doesn't make sense to interpret this value.